What is competitive free riding? Well, after years of having fun, people began to wonder who was best. And so it began. A crew of skiers held a competition in Alaska. Next was Switzerland with the extreme verbia. Gradually, these contests spread across the world and joined together as a single tour. And so it went global. The big shot. But in the end, it comes down to one rider atop a mountain. And while safety equipment is abundant, the rules remain remarkably simple. There's a start on a peak and a finish at the bottom. There are no gates, no piste, no clock, and there's no practice run. Riders rely on a visual inspection and their imagination to create a line. Runs are judged using five subjective criteria, which means any approach or style has the potential to win. For riders, the pressure is immense and the margin between success and failure narrow. Over the years, competition has driven the sport to new heights and now the only certainty is progression. This is competitive free riding.